Southgate's England are almost ready for Russia Traditionally, World Cup warm-up games are used to iron out any kinks before the real action begins. For England, though, their upcoming friendly fixtures against Nigeria and Costa Rica, their last outings before the big kickoff against Tunisia and Volgograd on June 18, come with rather more meaning attached, with just two weeks until the start of the World Cup, Gareth Southgate's side is far from settled. He will take the youngest England squad in a generation to a major tournament this summer and with that comes a sense of uncertainty, unpredictability. These friendlies must be used to come up with a formula for the World Cup. For starters, Southgate must decide on a first-choice goalkeeper. Joe Hart has been left out of the 23-man squad, but that still leaves the England manager with Jack Butland, Jordan Pickford and Nick Pope to pick from. Ideally, a number one would have been anointed a long time ago, giving them time to familiarize themselves with the backline, but this is the situation England find themselves in. At right back, there are also questions to be answered. Kyle Walker would be the natural pick of many, but he could play on the right side of a defensive three instead, leaving a wing back place open. That place could be filled by Kieran Trippier or Trent Alexander-Arnold. It's a similar tale on the left side, where Ashley Young and Danny Rose will surely compete for a starting spot. In midfield, the injury to Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain has opened up a place. England are perhaps at their weakest in the center of the pitch with Southgate yet to establish a unit in there. Eric Deer and Jordan Henderson can probably expect to start the opening game against Tunisia, but beyond that everything is up for grabs. Harry Kane is perhaps the only player in the whole squad who can be sure of his starting place, but following a common trend throughout England's team, his supporting cast has still to be decided. A few months ago, Dele Alli would have been assumed to be an automatic pick, but injuries and a recent dip in form has opened the door for others, including Jesse Lingard, who comes into this World Cup on the back of his best-ever season. Raheem Sterling can also be fairly confident of a starting place in Southgate's preferred team, but where will he play? If he is to be used in the same way he is at Manchester City, does that mean England will play three in attack? These are just some of the issues Southgate must address over the next week. These friendly outings mustn't be wasted. Your browser doesn't support HTML5 video. World Cup Iconic Moments, Calendar the 20th of June 2006 Stadium Rhein Energia Stadion, Cologne Joe Cole scores an incredible goal, on the volley from 35 yards, to put England into the lead in their groupie game against Sweden. Moment the Golden Generation, shown. HTTPS colon slash slash t dot co slash lop 9 lo 3 mm 349 pm the 28th of May 18.